Hey guys, my name's Sam and welcome to PrepMedic. In this week's video, we're discussing the extended austere provider class put on by Soar Rescue. All right, so I just got done taking the EAP course, um, Extended Austere Provider, and as you saw, it is a pretty in-depth course that covers a lot of really cool topics. Um, you know, the first couple days are uh, more or less classroom-based, although there's a lot of hands-on thrown in there. Um, you go over everything from pathophysiology of various issues down to vent management, and then uh, you go into more clinical procedures such as POCUS, chest tubes, surgical cricothyrotomies, um, advanced airway management, things like that. So if you're looking at taking this course, I would really recommend you have a strong foundational knowledge of medicine. You know, at the very least you have to be an EMT, but I would recommend, you know, this is for those uh, paramedics, um, you know, nurses, people that have at least a semblance of a critical care background um, to fall back on or are looking to get into that realm. Uh, they're really good at tailoring the class to the people in it. You know, we only had five people in ours and they capped the class at 10. So they do devote a lot of time to teaching you up if you'd wanna learn a new skill. You know, this is not a wilderness first aid course. This is how do you manage an ICU level patient for a long period of time. Um, and then the last day is a scenario, which I don't wanna give a whole lot away if you're gonna take it, um, but it's extensive. You have to manage a patient for an extended period of time as the name would imply. Um, and then kind of live out in the wilderness. Uh, you know, I really enjoyed this class. Um, this is the first one I've taken by Soar Rescue, uh, although I've heard great things on a lot of their other courses. You know, they've got um, their TMP, Tactical Medical Provider. They've got a TAME course, which is kind of the next step up from this course, which talks about like air evac and um, critical care in the transport environment and austere settings and non-traditional platforms they've got a pretty extensive rope rescue class. So if you're looking at taking a course from very knowledgeable instructors um, in a really cool area, they also travel, I would highly recommend Soar Rescue. Guys, if you have any questions about this or anything I talked about or showed, leave them in the comments down below and I will see you next week. Yeah.